All right, what's up, YouTube? Check it, check it, check it. Just a quick reaction. Um, everybody saw the game yesterday between the Niners and the Cowboys, and I seen on Instagram that Neville Gallimore posted that he'd taken all the blame for the penalties and everything else, but realistically, he wasn't to blame. And to us Cowboy fans, we need to do better than this because that man's family had nothing to do with the game. That was wrong for Cowboy fans to threaten or whatever the case may be. Not right. We are better than everything else because right now, not cool. Neville Gallimore, you're not at fault. Prescott, you're not at fault. Anybody on the offensive line, defensive line, special teams, you know, you guys are not at fault. And there's a few coaches that are not at fault. One is a special team coach. Our fossil and our defensive coordinator, Dan Quinn, not at fault. Yes, the players made mistakes. Everybody does. Who doesn't? But for Cowboy fans to to take it to the extreme to where you got it, threaten someone's family, it's really ridiculous. I'm a Cowboy fan always to the fullest. I'm always going to represent it. But I'm going to represent it in a smart way. This is not cool. Neville Gallimore, you guys are, you're not wrong at all. You're not at fault at all. Everybody's at fault. You know, and that's that's sad, dude. That is really sad. I, I'm, I'm just shocked by the whole situation. This is really crazy. Like, it hurts to see somebody that busted their tail and like my cousin posted. <clears throat> Y'all are just taking the game way too extreme. Why don't you go switch with them and do their job? Because you guys would not be able to do what they do. You got over 350 pounders, big linemen, some wide receivers, tight ends, linebackers, get hit by them, do the job that they do with every day where they get head injuries, neck injuries, knee injuries. You know, I can go on, but... To you Cowboy fans that are actually threatening this man's family is really ridiculous and really disgusting. And I really hope you guys really think before you react and say things that you can't take back. Because I'm pretty sure they already know who disrespecting or threatening, whatever the case may be, to Neville Gallimore's family and whoever other Dallas player that's being threatened because they made mistakes and did some penalties that, you know, yeah, could have been taken, could have been better, but nobody's perfect. But that's just what I just wanted to get off my chest because this is wrong. Neville Gallimore to the Cowboys, y'all, you guys are somewhat at fault to the, to the penalties, but not to the extent to where you're getting threats. No, not at all. That's just coming from me. But anyways, what's your guys' thoughts on this? Because this is ridiculous, dude. The ones that really should be at fault, the ones that really should be blamed, are one, Kelly Moore. Horrible play calling. Way horrible play calling. All these play callings towards the end when you could have done it in the first two quarters, we, who knows where it could have been. It's a woulda, shoulda, coulda, do that. But whatever. And the other one that's at fault is those damn referees. The NFL needs to do something about that because this is ridiculous because they're taking the fun out of the game. And look at what the reaction they're getting from um, from fans, not just from Dallas. Look at the fans from the Rams, the Raiders. I can go on, but it is what it is. But everybody knows that the NFL is rigged. The NFL has been always been rigged. That never want to do anything to change the aspect of how these officiating are calling the games nowadays. But that's just my thought. But what do you guys thought? Like, subscribe, anything that you guys want to do. If you guys want to help me out, appreciate it. But until again, deuces. I ain't rich. I ain't famous. I'm just a regular person like y'all. So, bye.